Hey guys, what is going on? Hope y'all are having a good one. Thanks for coming, tuning into the video today. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe if you haven't already done so. It's much appreciated. If y'all are new here, welcome aboard. I know I've gained quite a bit of subscribers today. Much to my surprise, but I am extremely thankful. Thank you guys for blowing up the channel. It, it means a lot. We're going to take a cruise today. Down a somewhat windy back road. And play with the new exhaust yet again. It's my new favorite toy. I'm like a kid on Christmas. this water the air temperature is so much cooler and in the shade it feels amazing like the twisty signs. It's my favorite song. More twisty song. Twisty songs are good. I like twisty songs. me that's why I'm all the way over here that's the last place I want to land is in a side of a mountain with rock although I think the exhaust sounds better next to the rock
than I anticipated. YouTube channel? I did order some shorty levers, so hopefully it'll be easier for me to get on the brakes. Cause I feel like my fingers, like my fingertips barely get to the levers. So I got some adjustable shorty, so hopefully that'll help with that issue. Or maybe that's just noob of problems, I don't know. try them out and see if it makes any bit of a difference. I'm hopeful.
love the new noises. I just can't get over it. Love the new noises. Making these curves too hot and narrow. I know I am, but I keep I keep messing it up. And like I know I'm doing it, but I still continue to do it. I'm trying to get better about coming in wide and cutting the corner in. You can take the corners a lot faster that way. But it's so hard to get your mind to do it. Or at least it is for me. I thought it was just a patch, but it was probably every bit of an inch higher than the actual road itself. Ooh, that was slick gravel. Like more slick than normal. See, I like roads like this because honestly, you know, you can push the 300 to its limits. You can push yourself to your limits without feeling like you're blowing the thing up trying to just maneuver down a road. I mean, you can run this road in third or fourth gear and have the time of your life at 35 miles an hour, 40 miles an hour, 50 miles an hour, whatever. And you're, you're putting everything down the road can hold. You know, if you're in a 600, obviously you're going to have more fun on the interstate or open highways. If you get in a road that you're running hairpin turns, 15 mile an hour turns, 20 mile an hour turns, this is all you need. This is going to be, I mean, this is going to give you the blast, the most bang for your buck. You're not one, two, one, two, one, two. I mean, you can still run through the gears just fine. And I mean, you're actually working the bike and giving it everything you can without overdoing it and that's probably one of my most favorite things about the bike honestly that and the fuel mileage you can't compete with the fuel mileage had to make sure I'm still recording I talked to myself for an hour the other day always the best feeling go out record a video for a couple hours come back realize your camera hasn't even recorded the whole time to say the least I went the long way home today usually it takes me about eight minutes to get home from putting my gear on to pulling in my driveway I left work 45 minutes ago and I'm still 15 minutes from the house. Gotta love it. Accident, quote unquote. Oh wow. 
really moving along on that motorcycle there, any? Again, I mean, while we're riding behind this Tahoe, I mean, not really much going on. I want to thank y'all again. I mean, y'all have absolutely blown the channel up. I know I had a goal set for the month of July to hit 200 subscribers, and I completely failed that. But we're starting off insanely strong. I know for a fact, by like 12 o'clock today, I'd already gained five subscribers to the channel. So I just want to thank y'all for joining in. It's much appreciated. And let's keep growing. Because I'd still like to hit a thousand by the end of the year for sure. My out of the reach goal would be a thousand by the end of September. And if we can do that, I mean, let's absolutely smash the subscribe button. But if not, I would really. I mean, my goal is set at the end of the year to have a thousand subscribers. That's been my day one goal. I don't remember if I said that earlier on in my videos, but that was my goal was to have a thousand subscribers by the end of by the end of the year. I mean that's my dead set goal and I'd like to hit it. And I can only do it with you guys. I'm putting out daily content. I mean that's all I can do. And that's on top of my home life and on top of working 40 to 50 hours a week. So I'm really busting my tail to put videos out. All I ask is that y'all subscribe to the channel. And if you don't like the channel, all you gotta do is comment down below and, and let me know. I'm still a new channel. I'm literally doing everything from my phone. I don't have a computer to edit or anything like that. I mean, I started from zero. And obviously I, I went out and got the gear the camera, the mic, I got everything I needed essentially to do the videos. So once I'm actually over a thousand subscribers and you know, if I start making income with the channel, all the income from the channel will go back into the channel. As far as editing, if I buy a computer, I'll upgrade my bike, all that. I mean, that's all going to come from this is all an investment, so everything that goes into it, or comes out of it, is going back into it. So, I just need y'all's support. If you like the videos, make sure you comment down below. Let me know you like the content. If you don't like the video, comment down below and let me know. And it will be addressed. Because I make the content, obviously I enjoy making the content, but inevitably I make it for you guys. If not, I wouldn't post it to YouTube. I just want to know, want you, want to let you guys know that I do appreciate every each and every one of you. I appreciate each and every comment. I think that shows because I literally reply to every single comment on my channel. So I think that goes without being said. Sorry for this bill. I just want to make sure everybody is on the same page. And I want y'all to know what my goals are for the channel and go from there because if I don't have goals there's nothing I mean there's no reason for me to do it there's nothing to be reached with the channel with asphalt and tar.
and it stinks. It hurts and it stinks. It hurts and it stinks. I did notice earlier when I hit 7,500 RPM and drop the throttle, I get an awesome, perfect backfire. Check this out, guys. 7,500, drop it, wow. Every time. It's awesome. I've literally been playing with my exhaust. I probably drove for 20, 30 minutes before I started recording, just playing with my exhaust. That's it, just literally playing with my exhaust. I play with it like it's a toy. guys that'll pretty much do it for the video today i'm coming into town so i'll go ahead and wrap the video up because we all know we don't like town rods you don't i don't it's just a boring rod so i'll go ahead and wrap the video up again i want to thank you all for joining in for chiming in for watching the video subscribing it means the world to me make sure you like and comment down below if you're new here you made it to then make sure you hit that subscribe button we're still trying to get to a thousand subscribers before the end of the year and the faster i get to my 200 goal from the previous month i mean it helps me out mentally because <laughs> i'm devastated that i didn't hit my goal i hate not getting my goals but obviously i mean tom is tom no big deal but i just want to thank you all for tuning in watching the videos supporting the channel and Make sure you all have a good day. We'll be back tomorrow with more daily content. Peace.